So hello, welcome back to general tutorial. We are now in the next topic under the differential calculus. Okay, last time we already tackled the chain rule and for the next topic we are now in the inverse function rule. Okay, in, in inverse function rule it is just a literal inverse uh, derivative. So, and by the way, if you are new here to my channel, please uh, don't forget to click the subscribe button and also hit the notification bell for you to be notified in our future uploads and also if you want to share it well I share this video you are free to do it so come on uh, let's try number eight okay under exercise three point to have, I mean two point three so in number eight we have the problem x is equal to y plus y squared okay plus y cube so before that let me rewrite the formula again we have d11 in d11 we have the formula dy over dx is equal to 1 over dx over dy okay the equation in number 8 we have the equation x is equal to y plus y squared plus y cube so literally the derivative of x with respect to y okay we will derive this x function with respect to y so dx over dy is equal to derivative of y is 1 derivative of y squared is equal to 2y plus the derivative of y cube is equal to 3y squared so we will input this uh, dx over dy in the d11 formula so the dy over dx is equal to 1 over 1 plus 2y plus 3y squared so so this is the final answer in number one okay let's try number two Okay, in number two we have the the x equation okay actually it is in number nine in this book okay we have x is equal to the square root of y plus the cube root okay plus the cube root of y so again we will derive this uh, x function with respect to y so that is equal to dx over dy is equal to the derivative of square root of y is equal to 1 over 2 square root of y plus the derivative of cube root of y is equal to 1 over 3 cube root of y squared so again for the d11 we have dy over dx is equal to 1 over 1 over 2 square root of y plus 1 over 3 cube root of y squared or we can say that this is also equal to okay, 1 over 3 cube root of y squared plus 2 square root of y all over by okay, 2 square root of y multiplied by 3 cube root of y squared so the final answer under the dy over dx I mean under the inverse function rule is equal to dy over dx is equal to 2 or 2 multiplied by 3 6 6 okay. square root of y multiplied by the cube root of y squared y Okay, raised to 1 over 2 plus uh, 2 over 3. So that is equal to 1 over 2 plus 2 over 3 is equal to, that is equal to um, 3 plus 4 all over by 6. That is equal to 7 over 6. This is 7 over 6 all over by the cube root of 3 cube root of y squared plus 2 square root of y. So totally this is the final answer. Let's proceed in the number 3 problem under the inverse function rule. So again for the third problem we have number 10. In number 10 we have x equation or x is equal to 4 minus 3y raised to 3 over 2. So again we will deriving this x equation with respect to y. So that is equal to dx over dy is equal to, okay we will using the basic rule or power rule in this problem. So that is equal to 3 over 2 multiplied by 4 minus 3y raised to 3 over 2 minus 1 multiplied by the derivative of 4 minus 3y. So that is equal to negative 3. So totally we have the value of dx over dy is equal to negative 3 multiplied by 3 is equal to negative 9 over 2 multiplied by 4 minus 3y okay, raised to 3 over 2 minus 1. So that is equal to 3 over 2 minus 2 over 2 or equal to 1 over 2. So again, using the inverse function rule, we have dy over dx is equal to 1 over dx over dy. So there is equal to 1 over negative 9 over 2 multiplied by uh, 4 minus 3y raised to 1 over 2. 
or it is just equal to negative 2 all over by 9 multiplied by or 9 square root of 4 minus 3y so so this is the final answer